Hello everybody, my name is Craig, and today I'm going to be showing you a plugin I am trying to, to design for a Pixelmon server for the Safari Zone. To anybody out there that is a plugin designer or developer, specifically for Java plugins in Eclipse or any other application that can make Java plugins, I would really appreciate some help with this. What I'm trying to do on this Pixelmon server that I helped it to design, it's an adventure server. I want to have the Safari Zone so you can stand right here and an NPC will be here or a invisible pressure plate and you type in Safari TP set time and I want it so you can set the time with the command if you're opt or have permission to that group so you can type 10 seconds, 10 minutes, or maybe an hour. And I want to be able to set it for 10 minutes, and it will set 10 minutes for a timer right here that you teleport back to as soon as you continue down the corridor. I would also be able to set the teleportation. So for example, x66 and then 66 and negative 577 that's where we are and you just type enter or you just leave it blank and wherever you're standing it automatically types it in and then I want it to be able to automatically give you money automatically say in chat only to you doesn't broadcast it to the entire server that you have 10 minutes or whatever amount you set it for automatically clears your inventory which it would have done here automatically gives you 30 safari balls and it automatically gives you an old rod and then to anybody that's not opt obviously it will you know won't allow you to open gates and fences so anybody out there that is a coder or a designer I would really appreciate your help with this and I may even pay you once I get my PayPal account deactivated because someone tried to hack it. It's nothing too fancy. I would also like it compatible with all Pixelmon versions if possible. That'd be really nice just in case anyone's running, you know, Pixelmon 1.0 on a server. Specifically, obviously, a Cauldron server. And uh, it's probably going to have to have compatibility with other plugins that are running on the server so you don't run into problems. But other than that, I would really appreciate appreciate some help from someone out there that has done designing for coding. I have an example right here of the code I have designed. All credit goes to Connor77. Thank you so much, Connor. As you can see here, everything looks fine. To anybody out there that's advanced in this, probably is laughing at me right now saying, I can't believe you tried this. This is not going to work. Yeah, I know there's a lot of errors here, or some errors I probably don't even see. Uh, right here, I had a coder help me and point out that there should be no A here. There should be an A here, I mean, because it will spam the server if you don't put an A there, because it schedules a sync delayed task only once instead of constantly spamming the server in the background. Now, as you can see, there are some errors that are detected. And I'm um, not very advanced in this. I'm more of a novice, so I cannot figure out the problems. So anybody out there that's done coding, I'd really appreciate your help. It's nothing too fancy, as you can see. Everything looks fine in some parts, but I cannot get it all to work. So to anybody out there, there's watching please leave a comment or private message me on my YouTube and I would really really appreciate it I'm sure a lot of you and other servers would love to use this plugin and I would just need some help you can contact me on Skype I will private message you my Skype the main reason why this isn't working right now is because the plugin.yml is not set up correctly uh, the permissions are there and the commands are there but it's not set up correctly to run so if any of you have any ideas I would really appreciate it and like I said I may even
pay you once I get the money. And, uh, yeah. 